Hi, my name is Terry Sproul and I want to welcome you to my studio. Today I'm going to show you a really fun product called the Fine Line Writer. So come on down to my desk and let's start playing. Okay, we're down here at my desk now and I want to show you how the Fine Liner comes. First you get is this bottle and the bottle comes completely empty and you can fill it with numerous different products including acrylic paint or even adhesive so that you could put down glitter or something in a fine line and then it has a couple different size nibs and the nibs go directly onto the bottle once you fill it with whatever product you want to fill it with normally I do not fill the whole thing I'll just put in you know a little bit at the bottom and start it a couple little hints I can give you um, a lot of times if I'm using like acrylic paint with it and I use a lot of acrylic paints I really like to use the metallics into my um, jars I usually will put either a glazing medium or some type of um, adhesive um, medium that will thin out the acrylic paint a little bit now let me show you how to use it First off, it comes with this um, protector that you want to put over it. And it's a little hard to show on video, but there's a fine um, needle that goes inside of the nib that will keep your nib clean. So you first off pull that off, and then you can go in and make some really, really fine detail on your projects and get some really close up things. So I'm going to zoom way in here on this flower and show you that I can make really fine dots in the center of that flower with and like I said I have acrylic paint in here so again I know it's a little hard to see but that's what's fun about this is you can get really fine lines and have some really fun with this including making some writing um, it just gives you a really nice little feel to get yourself some really cool fine detailed lines. Now the other thing that you can get with your um, in your fine line writer is now remember when you're done I always clean off my nib and then I take my um, needle and put it right down the shaft to protect that for future. You can also get a resist this is a lot of fun to resist. So let me show you how this works. Again, it works just like we um, do with the other one where you can um, put dots on your page. Now I put a bunch of dots or lines, it doesn't have to be dots, a bunch of dots on my page pr prior to you showing up so that it does have a chance to um, dry. So I took the resist and I made some dots on my page. And now I'm just going to take some basic um, adhesive, excuse me, some inks here and I'm going to go directly over my resist and get some color into that background as you see I've got going there. Once I'm done with all of my coloring and I would just continue and I'm not going to show you all that because you understand. Once I'm done, I can take those little resist dots that you see right there, pull them right off and they don't hurt your paper at all and now I have a resist and it's protected whatever I had underneath there and they see how quickly and easily they come right off so you could make lines, you can do writing all kinds of stuff and I have an instant resist I hope that you check this out, it's a very fun product and you can put multiple different mediums in there so have fun with it thanks again for stopping by